G'day, today we're going to do a quick video about stall stops and key starts in manual vehicles going uphill. So we've got a piece of adverse terrain ahead of us where we might need to come to a stop on that hill because we've run out of traction. We need to stop and secure the vehicle and then we need to securely get the vehicle back down to the bottom of the hill. Okay, so procedure is first gear low range we'll be heading up this hill in and we need to stop the vehicle when we run out of traction. All you simply do is put your right foot on the brake. Don't touch the clutch, don't touch the ignition, right foot on the brake. Once we've stopped the vehicle, then we need to secure the vehicle. Engage the park brake and then turn the ignition back one click. At this stage, we've got three forms of braking working for us. So we've got our foot on the brake, we've got our park brake engaged, and we got the engine compression holding us in gear on the hill. We're as safe and secure as we'll be. And if a muddy boot were to slip off a brake pedal, we've still got two forms of braking holding us to the hill. Okay, so now we're stopped and secured on the hill, we need to prepare to head back down the hill. While we're stopped, we need to find out the direction of our wheels. Very important to work out where your front wheels are pointing. Look on YouTube, four wheel drive rollovers, and I guarantee you they have no idea when they start backing back down that hill where their front wheels are pointing. Find out where your wheels are pointing. Now this is the only time in a manual vehicle while you're stopped and secured that you touch the clutch. Well, I like to refer to it as angel gear. Once you're, you've got the clutch disengaged, you're gonna need an angel. Okay, so while we're stopped and secured, slowly press the clutch, select reverse, and then take your foot off the clutch. That's the very last time you have to touch the clutch till you reach the bottom of the hill. So we're in reverse and we need to get back down the hill. Slowly disengage the park brake, and then even more cautiously, so we don't induce a slide, take your foot off the foot brake. Now we'll be resting on the compression of the engine. Check behind, because I guarantee you, when I get stuck, there's kids behind me, or even young adults behind me, taking photographs, putting it on Facebook, even before I'm down the bottom of the hill. So make sure you check and clear behind, it's very important. Now we're in reverse, our, our park brake is disengaged, our foot brake is off the, off the brake pedal, and we're ready to head back down. All you simply do is reach across and hit the ignition, start the vehicle in gear and roll back down the hill. That's it. Okay, let's get to it. Righto, off we go. Righto, let's get into it. First gear low range, let's head up this hill. Okay, I'm stuck. Put on the brake. Stall the vehicle. Now I need to secure the vehicle. Engage the park brake, turn the ignition off. I'm as safe as I can be on the hill. Three forms of braking working for me as I said before. Okay, so we're ready to head back down the hill. I can see where my wheels are pointing. I can go by my emblem also. All right, so prepare to head back down the hill. Slowly disengage the clutch. Pop it in reverse, very last time I have to touch the clutch. Disengage the park brake, and then very slowly disengage the foot brake until we're resting on the compression of the engine. And there we are. 
Okay, check and clear behind. Make sure there's no one behind us. Hit the ignition, reverse back down the hill. And that's it. It's as simple as that.